Hey guys, Justin Bryant here from SelfMadeSuccess.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to improve your AdWords cost per click. So I'm going to help you save money and get more out of your AdWords ads by showing you a few tricks that you can use to do so. Okay, so right now I'm on the AdWords keyword planner, where of course you already know you go to improve and find different keywords to use and they tell you the bid amount and things like that so you can find the ones you want to use in your ad campaigns so let's say you want to for example sell um, some kind of like an online franchise or you want to teach people uh, how to start an internet business okay so how to start or let's say start internet business okay let's say that's the keywords you're basically looking for that would really reach your target market okay so what comes up is a very expensive keyword okay start internet business is very competitive high competition searches aren't really that great either but the suggested bid is almost forty dollars so you obviously don't want to pay that much and so if you are on a budget you might have to do a few things like for instance you might have to change your keywords and you might have to do that by using the keyword filters okay so you come over here and what you want is low competition obviously the less competition the less you pay so then you do suggested bid okay what are you willing to pay for so let's say you're trying to really bargain for this you, you want to pay less than two dollars or you want to pay two dollars or less per click okay and average month monthly searches let's say you know you want to have decent monthly searches but you, you don't necessarily have to go after the biggest one so let's just say a minimum of let's just say a minimum of 100 searches a month okay just for the sake of this example so you save that it updates and it doesn't have anything for start internet business because that's very competitive but you can see a few things that are related like earning money online ways of making money online making money on the internet and things like that okay so if you're trying to start a business you start a business to make money you don't just start a business because you know you're bored so figure out the intent of who you're going after and use these keyword filters to help you find better keywords okay so these are a lot more uh, reasonable in cost it's a dollar sixty eight suggested bid dollar eighty eight so you can do things like okay earning money online making money online that tends to work better so let's try make money online and see what kind of ideas it comes up with now okay so you see this and you're using the keyword filters that's 287 so it's a lot more reasonable but then you narrow it down even more to online money making earning money online so people that want to start a business online are typically going to search these types of things anyway because their intent is to make money online by starting a business in the first place so this can get you about the same conversion rates as someone who wants to start a business but it saves you a lot of money on cost per click and you're getting quite a few views as you can tell so another thing I would do if I was you is um, if you're looking to find long tail keywords I would go to Google and just put in you know make money online okay so comes up with some search results and what you do is you go down to searches related to make money online so it gets a little more specific it shows you some variances um, so you can go through these you can click on them so make money online with Google okay so you could narrow it down to that people who want to make money online with Google okay then it goes for free then it goes from home okay so you can just go through and click back and forth between the searches related to what you typed in and come up with all sorts of long tail keywords because obviously that's the key to getting your cost per click down is using the long tail keywords to um, get your cost down and get your competition down okay so when you're doing that you got the keywords you know how to get keywords you know how to filter them 
now you also have a landing page you, your landing page is where obviously these people go when they click the ad okay where are they going now Google AdWords has quality um, guidelines and they show you a quality score and the better your quality score is the less you'll have to pay for your cost per click and the better your people will convert to leads or sales depending on what your business is most likely you're trying to collect email or phone number information so you have a landing page and it's geared towards you know starting a business making money online that kind of stuff but what you want to do is to completely get your quality score as high as possible and to get the best cost per click you can you want to make specific lead pages for each keyword phrase especially the ones that get at least 500 searches a month okay so if, if you are so like I said selling a course on how to start a business online you can do online money making low competition 1000 searches is pretty low uh, cost per click you don't have to worry too much about your competition and uh, what you do is you make a page where all you all they can do is opt in and get a free course or a lead some kind of um, lead magnet in exchange for their email or their phone number but you should use words like how to make money online or online money making course things like that you should use the exact keyword phrase in your capture page and do that for each one of your keywords instead of having a one-size-fits-all capture page okay so let's recap real quick you need to use long tail keywords use the keyword filters after you found a variance of something that actually is within your budget use the keyword filters make sure it's low competition make sure you're getting at least a hundred searches a month and make sure your bid is where it needs to be based on whatever your budget is And if you need more long tail keywords to use for your ads go to Google type these things in um, that will that are similar to what you're looking for and go to the bottom where it says searches related to make money online with Google or make money online whatever whatever you typed in it'll have these eight search results at the bottom and you can use them for more keywords as well okay and then after that you want to make a lead capture page for each keyword phrase over about 500 or so monthly searches okay you want to be specific with the exact keyword phrase in the title so that it is exactly what the visitor is looking for okay so that's how you get better cost per click on your AdWords campaigns if you got something from this video if you learned a little something please like it and subscribe don't forget to visit me at selfmadesuccess.com if you want to contact me directly if you want to ask a question if you want to get more in-depth resources more in-depth tutorials some better uh, tools that will help you get better results as far as starting a business whether you're looking to just become a better entrepreneur or if you're looking to improve a business you already have you can go there for that and don't forget to leave a comment if you want to add to this let us know another AdWords strategy that you've been using or let us know your experience with um, keeping cost per click down using AdWords uh, we'd love to hear from you and that's about it for this video I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one